today we're going to look at cylinders and how to find the volume of a cylinder. Okay, we have two different types of cylinders. We've got your standard cylinder, and the definition of a cylinder is a three-dimensional figure where you have two circular bases. Now this one is straight up and down, and that's a cylinder, and then we have another one where the bases are parallel to each other, but they don't stand one on top of the other. They are offset, and we actually call this an oblique cylinder. So there are oblique cylinders, but you would find the volume the exact same way. Okay, to find the volume, it's very similar to finding the volume of a prism. You just take the base area times the height. The only difference, the base area of a cylinder is, of course, a circle. So to find the area of the circle, we just use the area formula, which is pi r squared. So we're going to take pi r squared times the height of the pyramid, or the cylinder. So let's throw in some numbers. Let's go over here and give ourselves a radius of 4 and a height of 3. What would be the volume? Well, you just go over here and plug into your formula R being 4, H being 3. So pi times 4 squared times 3. Well, 4 squared is 16 times 3 is 48. And we're just going to attach the pi to the back, so 48 pi. And since this is volume, our units are always three-dimensional because volume is length, width, and height. And notice we're taking radius squared, which is area, times height, which gives us the third dimension. So that is going to be inches, um, centimeters, whatever, cubed. So there's our answer.